Um, my name is Cody and my husband is Charlie. We are the Roaming Lions. Um, come on inside and I'll show you our schooly conversion. So I'm going to give you a full on tour. Um, this is the cockpit up here. We really didn't convert much up here. Uh, the only thing I think we really added is our backup camera and then the, oh gosh, I've never remember Brake controller. Brake controller for if we are going to tow like a trailer or anything like that. Um, moving on back, this is our captain's chair. This is a chair we found at a used auto sales dealership. Um, we bought it for 100 bucks, and then we bought the swivel mount um, from eBay for 80 bucks. So it does swivel around, uh, so you can converse with people on the couch, or also check out our awesome pellet stove. Uh, this is a castle pellet stove. So it does have like a thermostat on it, um, so you can set like a different temperature, you can set a time or date that you want it to turn on and it will do that. Um, it runs off of wood pellets. I'll show you what they look like right here. So that is what it runs off. You just fill this hopper up with it. Um, it'll run for hours. So you don't have to wake up in the middle of the night and feed some wood planks into your wood stove. This thing will run for hours and it'll keep it nice and toasty warm. Um, moving on back, this is our huge uh, flat screen TV. It is on a nice little swivel mount. And then you can also tilt it up and down. And then over here is our couch. Um, we bought this off of Wayfair. And it does, I'm not going to show you just because Char wants to make a quick little video. Um, but it does fold down into a full size bed. And then walking back, this is our kitchen. Um, everything, pretty much everything you see in the kitchen is from Ikea. The cabinets, the countertops, the sink, the faucet, all from Ikea. The stove is Avanti brand. We did buy that off of the internet. I'm not sure of the website, but I could help you find it if you needed. Um, the baskets are from Amazon. The magnet strip I think we bought from Ikea as well. Uh, this is our fridge. It is technically, I think it's called a uh, portable chest freezer. It is by the brand Winter. Um, I believe it's around nine cubic feet in the inside. Um, and uh, we bought this from Home Depot. You can take a peek inside if you want. It's quite a bit of space. This little basket you can move around, take out. And this runs off of AC and DC power dropped a magnet. Our ceiling I custom did. They are pine tongue and groove planks. Um, I did the finish myself and the ceiling is also insulated with foam spray insulation. Our flooring is the life proof uh, luxury vinyl planking. This is our beautiful dog Mia. Um, I believe the color is sterling oak. You can find this at Home Depot. It's awesome. We love it. Uh, the insulation we did on the floor is an uh, inch and a half thick foam board insulation. The walls are all insulated with fiberglass insulation. I believe it's R14 or F R15. Um, and then the Wayne's coating we also got from Lowe's. And then the finish trim here is just a nice piece of pine uh, finish board. We stained it. And then also up top is the same trim. It's about a six inch pine finish board. That is going throughout the walls of the bus. When you come back, we have our pantry here. This is custom made by my husband. I absolutely love it. I highly recommend that if you're doing a pantry, please just take the time, make the drawers. I think you will be so happy you did because you have so much more storage. You can get to things that are in the very, very back of the cabinet, super easy. Um, you can access them from this side and the back. They're on a dampening drawer system as well. And these actually don't move while we're traveling. My husband made them kind of tight pretty snug so they don't move when we're traveling which is awesome um next I'll show you our bunk beds these are a little bit smaller than a twin size bunk 
and they do have storage in both of them. This is where we keep most of our clothes. Um, so it's super quick, super easy to access, super easy to open up and down. Um, it doesn't even affect the bedding or anything like that. And then we have some cute little lights, reading lights here. I got those for a dollar at Walmart. Uh, they were on sale, of course. I don't think they're originally a dollar. Um, these are our insulation curtains. I made them all for the bus, um, for all the windows in the bus, I guess I should say. They are made out of Reflectix and then just white fabric. So the Reflectix goes uh, in the window. And they definitely make a difference in the winter time. Um, here is our utility closet. It's probably the roughest because we didn't finish it out. But this is our breaker box right here. And then we also have a switch to run. We run on uh, shore or our generator and we can switch from that. And then over here we have our hot water heater. And then we just have some random things mounted in here like our uh, vacuum, um, a holder for Walmart bags, our laundry bags are in here so we can just throw our dirty laundry in here. We have a fan, just some other random things. A nice little platform over the wheel well just to throw some stuff in there. Um, and then I made this curtain here as well. Coming on back, I'll show you our shower room. Um, the shower pan we bought off of Amazon, it was like 30 bucks. It's one of those like water trough things. So we got that from there. Um, then we have a little handheld shower thing in here. Sorry, I'll jump in. And you know, it has a little on and off switch so you can conserve water that way. Track system, all that's from Amazon. You can check that or um, just comment and ask and we'll be more than happy to help you with what we did here. The walls um, throughout the, the inner walls of the bus are the same tongue and groove pine planking. Um, I just painted that white. And then obviously the structures, two by fours. I'll show you our toilet room next. Um, we have the Nature's Head composting toilet. We haven't used it, but we've only heard great things about it, so we're excited to use that. And then I'll uh, switch to sides again. This is our vanity sink faucet combo, all from Ikea, and the mirror as well is from Ikea. And the, these drawers are also on the dampening system. We haven't had any issues with them opening up as we were driving, so it's worked really well. And then last but not least is our bedroom. Um, so, let's see here. The lights up here are from Ikea. Oh, I unplugged that one. That. And then this is our mini split. So it is our AC, but then it also has heat as well. That is up there. Then we have a little fan over here. Um, you can charge the battery in it. It's battery operated. Um, we use it. We like to have a fan running when we're sleeping. So it lasts, I think, like 48 hours or something without a charge. Um, so it's really nice. And then we also have another TV mounted over here. Oh. Just like that. Oh, did you want to show the... The wall? <laughs> yeah. It's just cool. It just looks cool. Um, we stained this wall for like a little accent. And then our bed also lifts up. It is on the gas struts. It lifts up for more storage down here. And then on this side, you see our freshwater tank. It is a 100 gallon freshwater tank. And then our water pump is down there. 
that is a quick little tour of our bus. Um, hope you enjoy. Have any questions um, about where we bought something, how we did something, anything like that, leave a comment down below. We'd be more than happy to help you guys. So thanks for watching.